The Hofburg Palace in Vienna was the winter home for Viennese royalty for centuries, but today it's open for exploration. Come follow along with me. The Hofburg Palace is located in the heart of downtown Vienna and has been a focal point of Viennese life and culture for centuries. The official winter home of the royal Habsburg family since 1279, this palace attracted aristocracy and celebrity in droves, and so had the glamour and luxury to match. This is where we're going to be having our ball. Today the palace is still the seat of power for Austria and its president, and is open to the public for tours, events, and yes, even balls. One morning, my friend Jess and I decided to tour the palace while our husbands were stuck in meetings. We are outside the Hofburg Palace today. We're going to try and go in and explore the rooms, check out the museum. Anything else you want to do? Oh, it's just gorgeous just walking around. So much sleep, so much history. You can even find old Roman ruins in the front courtyard of the Hofburg. The exterior of the palace was beautiful and gives you an idea of the treasures to be found within. We toured the Kaiser Apartments and the CC Museum inside, where photography and videos were very limited. But here's what I managed to acquire. The Imperial Apartments featured a lot of dinnerware, like a lot of dinnerware. And this was the only place videos were really allowed as well. However, the dinnerware displays did a great job of conveying the extreme wealth of the Habsburg dynasty. Past the extravagant candelabra section, the Imperial Apartments began. The tour was very similar to the Schönbrunn Palace tour, and again, videos were not allowed. I have snuck a few shots of the rooms in the Sisi Museum, as I do have a newfound obsession with the Austrian Empress Sisi, who lived a glamorous yet tragic life, and may have been the creator of the first home gym. I just had to have a couple shots. Of course, you need to visit the apartments and CC Museum yourself to appreciate the full grandeur of it all. My shaky clips don't even do it justice. After being shuffled out through the gift shop, this happened. We've stumbled onto some sort of um, presidential visit, so we're pretty lucky.
We were actually unable to stay to see the two presidents meet and shake hands because we had to leave and pick our husbands up from their meetings. Our tour of the Hofburg was interesting and a great way to spend a morning in Vienna. I definitely recommend it. If you enjoyed this video, leave me a big thumbs up and tell me what you liked. For anyone new to my channel, please consider subscribing. I'd love to have you join my travel community.